Hi, everybody. Welcome to World Taiji Qigong Day. My name is Kathy Young, for anybody who's new here. And welcome to all the people who know me, the, my students, my good friends, all your supporters. I'm so grateful that you're here, including my family. My mom's here too, and I think my uncle and aunt. So I'm going to raise the roof. So happy for World Taiji and Qigong Day. Yay, everybody raise the roof with me as high as you can. Let's celebrate World Tai Chi Qigong Day. This means one world, one breath. Inhale deeply and exhale. Two more times in, out. Yay. So welcome to my 20 minute training for the Tai Chi form. Today, we're going to work on something called the Yang style Tai Chi form. Yang style Tai Chi is one of the best known Tai Chi for relaxation. Like the movements are very round, very soft, and very relaxed. Total, there's 108 movements in the Yang style Tai Chi form. The first part has 22 movements. So today we're going to save 10 minutes at the end to do the whole first part, 22 movements, for anybody who already knows it. And you're welcome to follow along if you haven't learned it yet. Today we're going to focus on Tai Chi, something called the Pong Lu Ji An. In Chinese, it's more Lui, Pong Lui Ji An. Pong. This is one of the most basic postures in Tai Chi. This means ward off, like I'm protecting my space and I'm warding you off. Ri, this means roll back, like a tug of war. I'm pulling a rope, I'm pulling the person off balance. There's a little movement called a signature move. I like to think of you're holding a bowl of water and you're dropping it. Signature move just means we're on the same team because Tai Chi originated as a martial art. So if we're on the same team, we know not to fight each other. We have this movement called Qi and you're squeezing like an accordion. So like you're playing music and you're squeezing or giving a hug. You're opening your hands. You're going to push forward into what's called An. An in Chinese means push, like you're pushing a car. So Tai Chi, I want to emphasize, it's so simple and so, so possible for everyone. And Tai Chi can be good for your health. So everybody, we're going to learn these four simple movements. And I'm going to give you an analogy so you can think of it, how to remember the movement. So if everybody can bring your left arm up by your chest, and your right arm by your belly, like you're holding a big beach ball and you're holding it from north and south and you're going to rotate the ball to your right into east and west and repeat. Very good. This is called Pong, P-E-N-G. That means word off. Imagine you're finding your space. Can everybody put your arms in front and find what is your space? This is the space that you protect. The moment you open it, you're vulnerable. All your vulnerable points are in the center line. So everybody, let's close that gap. Mind the gap and protect your space. And you roll off any force that comes towards you, like a ball rolling off any power. Inhale. Exhale, grow out a bit. Very nice. So this is Pong, ward off. The second movement will be Ri. When we rotate this ball 
the second movement, you're going to imagine you're pulling on a rope. So grab that rope from your right hand and left hand, from your right. Remember, I'm opposite of you. And everybody, let's pull that tug of war rope. Really root yourself to the ground. Imagine they're pulling you forward and you're pulling them back. And repeat. Pull that rope. Inhale. Exhale. In. Out. Good. Let's put those two together. So you have the big beach ball that's palm ward off. Let's rotate that ball to the right. And we have re, roll back, pulling that rope, and combine it, palm, re, palm, re. Very good. So those are the first two movements of the four set. We have Pong, that big beach ball. B, roll back, tug of war. Let's do a little subtle movement. This is a signature move, like you're signing your signature. Everybody imagine you're carrying a bowl of water in your left palm and hold it by your left waist. And then try to imagine you're turning that bowl of water over until you can't hold it anymore and you just drop it. Uh, this is a signature move, a coil. Very good. So that's just the subtle movement in between. As we transition to the third movement called G, J I G, everybody think of G as squeezing, like you're giving a big hug. And squeeze in, big hug, and squeeze in. Or like you're squeezing an accordion. Let me hear you play some music. Very good, so that's G, squeeze. And just finish by aligning your muscle, the thumb muscle on your left hand. Give me a thumbs up with your left hand. Yay. And give me a thumb muscle with your other hand. Good, and everybody let's squeeze it together. You're going to hold your hands together, turn your right hand horizontally. And you're aligning your pinky muscle on the left with your thumb muscle on the right. And then rest your fingers, keep it relaxed, and squeeze. Hands together. Good. So this connects to organ channels that we'll talk about from a Chinese medicine point of view, from your lungs and your heart. Everybody, let's put those three movements together. We have the ward off, palm. Re, roll back. Signature, bowl of water. And G, squeeze for a hug. Aligning your pinky on your left with your thumb muscle on the right. And repeat. One more time with me. Let's do it with breathing. 
Inhale deeply, holding the beach ball. Exhale as you turn. Re-roll back, inhale, and pull, exhale. Drop the bowl of water, inhale, exhale, and squeeze with the exhale. We're going to finish with the last movement called on, push forward. From this squeeze, squeezing that accordion, we're gonna open our hands at the shoulder height, a little above the shoulder, drop your elbows, at an angle, pull it up to your chest, fingers forward, and settle your wrist. And again, from squeeze, pinky in front. And try breathing with me. From the squeeze, we have an exhale. Open your hands, inhale. Down at an angle, exhale. Inhale like an elevator coming up. And exhale as you push that car. Settle your wrist. Inhale, exhale. In, out. In. Very nice. So let's put those four movements together. We'll do it with the breathing. And then we'll slowly add in a little layer of Chinese medicine so you can understand how you can improve your form for your own health. Ready to begin? Let's go. Pong, ward off, big beach ball. Ri, roll back, tug of war. Drop the bowl of water, signature. G, squeeze an accordion. And push forward, down at an angle, up to the chest, and push forward. With the breathing, let's go. Inhale, palm, ward off, exhale. Three, roll back. Hug a war. Signature. G, squeeze. Inhale. Exhale. And push forward. Inhale. And exhale. And repeat at your own pace three times. Very good, let's go one more time together. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Very good. So you'll see I'm moving my legs back and forth. This is called a rocking. So to add it in with the legs, we have organ channels going to the legs. We have six organ channels going to the hand. On the yin side, which is the palm, on the yang side, where you get the suntan, you have three yin organs in the inside of your legs. 
and three young organs on the outside of your legs. So let's use all our organs, organ meridians, and add in the legs. So you're going to bring your right leg forward and your left leg back, both toes pointing about 45 degrees. You're gonna sit back till about 60% of your weight is in the back and 40% of your weight in the front. This is called the 6-4 stand or 4-6 stand. In Chinese, 四六步. 四 means four, 六 means six. Feel the 6-4 stand. This is how you would be before you push a car. And then let me see you push off that back leg so you push the car all the way. Inhale. Push off that back leg till it's straight. Exhale. In. Good, and let me see you finish all the way when you push the car. You're in what's called a climbing mountain stand or bow stand. The back leg is straight, your hips are square, and your front knee is about right angle. And you sit back and you rock forward. In and out. Very nice. Let's put it together with the Pong Ri Ji An. This is one of the most common movements you'll do in Tai Chi. So let's find our stance and rock back and forth from Pong and rotate. Push off the back leg. Roll back, Ri, inhale. Exhale, sit back. Signature in. Squeeze out. In, open, and push forward. Exhale, out. And repeat three times by yourself with the rocking. Very nice. Let's do one more time together. I'll face forward. Pong. Push off the back leg. Re roll back. Six four stance. Signature. G squeeze climbing one. And push forward. Sit back. Inhale. Exhale. Push forward. Very nice. So use your intuition the way you would when you need to push a car, push a furniture, or just push around with your friends. Good. So remember these movements as we go through now the meridian and acupressure point. So we're going to begin first with a Tai Chi hand form. This is middle finger relaxed. Pinky and your thumb gently push back. This is also known as tile hand, like you would make a tile. Other hand, middle finger, pinky and thumb push back. 
Tai Chi hand form. This gently tenses on the sides from your pinky and your thumb, your heart channel on the pinky, and your lung channel on the thumb. And it channels your energy, your chi, stronger in the middle line. That's called your pericardium. And you make a heart or fist with your heart. And you wrap your heart like it's the best present you can give to anyone. The sac around the heart, this wrapping, is known as your pericardium. Peri means around. Cardium means heart. This is an organ in Chinese medicine. Pericardium makes your heart happy. So when you want to practice Tai Chi to help the health of your heart, to have joy, to have peace, try the Tai Chi hand form. Pinky push back, middle finger relax. This strengthens one of the key acupressure points. If you roll your middle finger gently to the center of your palm, where your middle finger touches, this is known as pericardium number eight. Roll your middle finger where your middle finger touches, pericardium number eight. Number one starts from the side of your chest and comes over from the middle line. Trace it all the way past your palms to the tip of your middle finger. And trace that with me side of the chest, middle line, middle of the palm, and the tip. And it's symmetrical on both sides. Let me see you trace on the other side. Give me a Tai Chi high five with your Tai Chi hand. Yay, I feel your pericardium eight, but your palace of power in Chinese Lao Gong. Everybody, let's trace pericardium energy from the heart all the way down the middle line, past your middle and the tip. And two more times. Very nice. Pericardium channel is so important if you want to prevent a heart attack from blockage of joy, lack of joy in your heart. This point connects with your diaphragm. Everybody make a little rainbow right at the bottom of your chest. Every time you take a deep breath, this diaphragm flattens out, letting your lungs fill with air. And you relax, exhale. Inhale, diaphragm, relax. This movement from your breath, from the diaphragm, connected with the pericardium channel. This massages your heart, helping the chi to flow in the right direction. So when you feel you have a stomach ache, nausea, indigestion, the belching is coming up, burping, acid reflux, the chi is coming up instead of going down. Massage these points for pericardium, especially in the Tai Chi form. This helps to relax your diaphragm so you can breathe better. Everybody try. Middle finger relaxed. And continue with Pong Nui Jian. With middle finger relaxed, more energy coming to your palace of power.
Very nice. Let the chi flow all the way to the center of your palm and beyond through your middle finger. Good. Feeling your breath go that much deeper, regulating your chi for your heart and your stomach area. Two more points on your hands. That's very important for your chi regulation in Tai Chi. We have another one called your heart channel. Your heart channel, when your heart is happy, you raise the roof and your heart energy starts from under your armpit. Everybody touch under your armpit. And let me see you raise the roof with Tai Chi hands. Celebrate World Tai Chi Chi Kong Day. Yay, and say, oh, I'm happy to see you raising my roof. My heart energy is high, and I'm giving you a big hug because my heart energy is coming out to you from under my armpit. Just make sure it's not smelly. and <laughs> Give me a big hug. Go side to side. Radiate that good heart for your Tai Chi energy. And take a deep breath. Very nice. Let's open our arms from underneath. Raise the roof with more heart energy for Tai Chi. Everybody, let's share this Tai Chi joy with the whole world. Let's give the whole world a big, big, big hug. A hug from our heart. And squeeze. Gently squeezing out side to side. Yay, celebrate that world Tai Chi spirit. And let me see you raise the roof with middle fingers again. Tai Chi hand form, raise the roof. Yay, let's give yourself a big, big, big Tai Chi hug all the way from under the armpits. Let it radiate to your hands. And give yourself the biggest Tai Chi balanced hug squeeze side to side. Good, and trace that heart energy with me from under your armpit, drawing a nice red line for heart fire, past the pinky side of your wrist crease, landing on the inside of your pinky, making a pinky promise from your heart energy to always take care of your heart. And trace that two more times, heart energy. on the pinky side. Very good. I'm going to show you two acupressure points on the heart energy channel, right by your wrist crease. This one raises your spirit in Tai Chi, helping your Tai Chi form to come from your heart, a place of love and fine energy. From the inside of your pinky, come down to your wrist crease. You'll feel a little tendon on your pinky side. You're gonna hop over that tendon and stay close to the tendon. Here in this little depression is your heart number seven, Spirit gate. This opens the gate to connect with your mind and spirit so that your energy comes from a finer level, a place of love. Let me see you wave the wrist crease. Good. And trace that other side past your spirit gate, sentiment. Deep breath, your spirit is your breath. Two more times.
Good. And last time, from under the armpit, you're going to come by your pinky side past the wrist crease. When we're doing the Tai Chi form, be aware where your pinky wrist crease is. Like when we're doing the beginning of the form, lifting it up, see how you're bending your pinky. This adds some spirit to your practice, helping you to calm your heart. One more point that we'll show for today is your lung energy on the opposite side of the wrist. Here, this is also good for your breath. For more spirit in your practice, on your thumb side, when you're full of inspiration from Tai Chi, from Chinese medicine, let's give a big thumbs up. Yay, from your thumb. This is part of your lung channel. And full of inspiration, you're going to come by the wrist crease. You're going to come under outer the thumb side. This is called your radial side towards the thumb. You have a little artery called your radial artery. And you're going to feel past the pulse of the radial artery right at the thumb side. So when you do the Tai Chi form, watch your pinky and thumb relax and moving your wrist crease. Other side, thumbs up. Your lung energy actually comes from the side of your chest going all the way to your thumb. And lung number nine is at the wrist crease. Everybody, see if you can feel the subtlety when you do the Tai Chi hand form. Feel the wrist crease on the thumb side for your lung, pinky side for your heart. Very good. So as we go through the 22 movements of the Yang style Tai Chi, pay attention to our wrist crease for today. There are more points that we can talk about, but we'll have to save that for another time. There's more next time I'd like to talk about conception vessel number one. This gives you a deeper breath all the way down to your perineum. That's the floor, your pelvic floor. You have another one for your kidney channel, from your waist, kidney channel comes from the bottom of your feet, past your knees, past your groin area, related to reproduction and sexual health, coming up, connecting with your lungs, taking that deep breath. So kidney channel from the bottom of the feet, knees, and groin area. So watch out as you do your Tai Chi form. Give this area a good squeeze. This helps regulate your hormones for a longer life. Look for the squeeze and open. Yay. So who's ready to do the Tai Chi form? Let's do it together for one world, one breath. Tai Chi high five. Let's do the 22 movements of the first part. Good. I'll mainly call out the names and with little description of the movement. Let's relax in our ready position. Tai Chi hand form. Relax your wrist on the thumb side for the lungs. Take a deep breath, closing our eyes. Feel the wrist crease on the pinky side for your heart. Another deep breath from the center of your palm to the soles of your feet. Four deep breaths, four gaze breathing. One more deep breath with a deep inner smile. Yeah. 
exhale, open our eyes. Let's begin with the first movement, Tai Chi beginning. Inhale. Up to the shoulder. Feel the wrist crease. Exhale, squatting down. Inhale, turn to your right. Grasp sparrow tail right. Exhale, middle fingers aligned. Pericardium channel. Gently kick with the left. Inhale, step back. Transition. Turn to your left. Grasp sparrow tail like splitting taffy. Inhale. We begin the Pong V G N. Kick to your right, kick with your right. Turn all the way to your right. Big beach ball. Pong. Ward off. Three. Roll back. Signature, inhale. Exhale, squeeze. Squeeze an accordion. Inhale. Exhale. On and push forward. Settle the wrist. Single whip. Inhale. Watch the wrist crease as you coil. And turn. Toes point forward. Single whip. Whip to the left. Whip to the right. Knees together. Open that heart energy under your armpit. Open up with the left. And push. Push to your left. Settle your wrist. Lift hands to the up posture. Dropping your hands. Bring in the right foot. Lift your arm and kick with the right. Turn facing the west wall. Open the right hand. White crane spreads its wings. Open the left. Holding it there, making space. Left toe touching. We begin brush knee. Turn to the right. Turn with the left. Brush knee left. Step forward left and push with the right. Settle the wrist. Plain guitar. Cross the center line with the right. Shift your weight from left to right. From behind the elbow, extend. I'm playing a guitar. Kick. Brush knee left. Left hand brush. Left knee. And push with the right. Transition. Pivot left heel, right toe. Right hand brush, the right knee. Push with the left. Transition, pivot right heel, left toe. Brush with the left. Left hand, brush, left knee. Push with the right. Holding it there, making space. Left, playing guitar. Cross center line. Settle your right foot. Transition, extend, kick with the left. Playing the guitar. Brush knee left. Left hand brush. Left knee. Side of the wrist. Circle the fifth. Pivot left heel, right toe. Right hand fifth. Kick with the right. Circle with the right fist. Pivot right heel, left toe. Parry, left hand. And punch, right hand. Seal tightly from behind the elbow. Turn your wrist and relax. Signature number two. Inhale. Exhale, push off the back leg. And embrace the tiger. Turn to the front. Return to the mountain. Inhale, back with the left. Back with the right. Settle your energy. Let's close our eyes for four deep breaths. Finding our center.
Two more deep breaths. Exhale with a big inner smile, radiating out for a big outer smile. Very nice, let's open that heart energy. And radiating out to your Tai Chi hands, one last Tai Chi high five. Yay, good job connecting Tai Chi with Chinese medicine. Key points, remember your wrist crease. And the Tai Chi hand form to radiate the energy to circulate your heart and your lungs and the diaphragm for better breathing, which is raising your spirit. Pong, big beach ball. Three, tug of war. Signature, drop the bowl of water. G, give me a hug. Squeal the accordion. And push forward. Like pushing a car. So awesome job. Thank you everyone for joining me. Everything that we taught today, this is slowly connecting Chinese medicine and Tai Chi for health. So this is a book that I'm working on with my father. And slowly you'll be hearing more and more how to connect each Tai Chi movement, like opening that armpit, watching your wrist crease to help with your organ health, to balance all of your body, your mind and your spirit. Yay, thank you very much, everybody. Happy World Tai Chi Qigong Day. Yay, and raise the roof for Tai Chi spirit. Thank you. If you'd like to join, my classes for more learning about Chinese medicine, Tai Chi and Qigong and Kung Fu. I hope you'll join me. Come to my website, tcmtime.com. It's time for traditional Chinese medicine. Thank you, everyone. Till next time, this is TCM Time. Keep letting your house shine. Yay, I'm gonna see who's here. So happy you all could join me for Tai Chi and Qigong Day. I saw Ed earlier. Hello, Ed. Are you at Javi World? Yay, Javi World. I got Teresa. Hey, Teresa, big heart and big hug. I got Jack Fried. Hey, Jack Fried. So happy you're here. Thanks for introducing me to your student. I got Norma. Hola, Norma from Argentina. Got Cheryl in Texas. Hey, Cheryl. Yay, thanks for joining. Big heart. I got Dr. Workman. Hey, Richard. Thank you for joining. Hope you to see you in Kung Fu tomorrow. I got Marsha, my big friend Marsha. Big hug. Yay. Happy you're here. Thank you for your support. I got Ricardo. Hola, Ricardo from Brazil. Obrigada. Uh, Maria. Hola, Maria from Argentina. Thank you for joining. Muchas gracias. Uh, I got Elisa, hola Elisa from south of Chile. And I saw Eri, her daughter. Muchas gracias, grandes abrazos and besos. <laughs> A lot of kisses. And thank you from Croatia. Thank you, Maya. And Filomena from Italy, Prati. <laughs> I got Gunnar from Iceland. Thank you, Gunnar, you're the best. Thank you for joining Tai Chi. And uh, Tony D, hey Tony, you're the best. Tony and Kathy, I like your name. <laughs> Good. Uh, thank you, Maya. Thank you, Ariana. Thank you, everybody, you're the best. Big heart. <laughs> Look at all those hearts. Thank you, everybody. Yay. Good, thank you, Amanda, from Argentina, too. Which is gracias. Everybody, big, big hug from your Tai Chi, tai Chi arts from under your armpits. Open your heart and let's keep up the Tai Chi Qigong spirit. Yay. Thank you. Good. Till next time, everyone. Big hearts and Tai Chi five. Yay. All right. Bye, everybody. Have a wonderful day and keep your deep breathing through your heart, pericardium, and lungs. Thank you. Thank you, Amanda. Bye, everybody. <laughs>